Thank you all very much for being here. I want to thank the Sky Room for making this possible. And I want to thank me and Ed's for their hospitality as well. And obviously, I thank each and every one of you for being here for me today. And I also thank those who couldn't be here today, but would love to have them because they got a commitment. I want to also thank my committee members for, uh, for making this possible and for arranging the, uh, this great event. As some of you may already know, I have spent the last three decades serving the public as a law enforcement professional. From my start as a military police officer and walking the tears of our state's prison system as a correctional officer to patrolling our streets as a Massachusetts State Trooper, I have committed my life to serving people and keeping them safe. Bristol County is in need of new leadership to effectively and efficiently run our correctional system. Public safety and fiscal responsibility will be my top priorities. From aspiring law enforcement professionals to active police officers, I have trained and educated many throughout the years. Some of those officers have joined me here today. Whether you're a police officer patrolling the streets, or a correctional officer keeping criminals behind bars, proper training and education is vital to everyone's safety. It's with these qualifications and background that I officially announce my candidacy for Sheriff of Bristol County. The Sheriff's Office is an integral part of our criminal justice system. It is, a, it is tasked with the primary responsibility of maintaining care, custody, and control of county inmates. Through its leadership can come safer communities with less crime. Public safety and fiscal responsibility must be a paramount concern of this important office. We need to get the finances of the Bristol County Sheriff's Office in order. Needless spending will come to a searching halt. The spending of millions of dollars appealing civil cases that have already been decided by the higher court will not be dragged on. It is time to stop using hardworking taxpayers' money for the purpose of promoting and perpetuating political machines. My administration will not be driven by ego. I will not give into political pressure. It is time we bring professionalism back to the Sheriff's Office that is so desperately needed. To operate effectively, efficiently, and fiscally sound, it must be managed by a highly experienced, well-educated, law enforcement officials who are committed to public safety, not politicians who are committed to political patronage. I will restore integrity, accountability, public safety, and fiscal responsibility in the Sheriff's Office. Morale that has been eroded as a result of political influences under the current Sheriff must be restored. Leadership must be accomplished through respect, not fear. Officers and staff will be hired and promoted based upon their qualifications and the contents of their character, not the content of their wallet. <laughs> Wasting taxpayers' money by utilizing hiring practices and making promotions based upon good old boy system, quid pro quo, and political affiliation will not be tolerated. <laughs> political influences within the Sheriff's Office has compromised the fiscal stability of the department 
due to the creating and maintaining of jobs that serve political interest, not public safety. I will implement programs that are proven to be effective, efficient, and economically sound. Programs will be proactive, not politically attractive. Programs should be designed to, to keep criminals in prison, not politicians in office. I will not waste hard-working taxpayers' dollars pursuing frivolous legal action for the purpose of gaining political exposure. When asked, I will assist local and state police departments in their efforts. I will not waste taxpayers' dollars duplicating their efforts for the purpose of promoting political image. Voters must not allow career politicians to utilize the budget of the Sheriff's Office as a means of creating jobs for political hacks for the purpose of greasing political inside machines, political machines. <laughs> Those who support me support change from politicians, politics, and fiscal irresponsibility to law enforcement, public safety, and fiscal responsibility. These are among the real issues that confront us today. And it is on the basis of these issues that the citizens of Bristol County must make their faithful choice for the future. In the past months, I've talked with many voters throughout the county in all walks of life. My candidacy is therefore based upon the conviction that I can win, win both the nomination and the election. The focus of this campaign is not how things were or are, but how things should be. The current sheriff has done too little for too long. It's time for the citizens to do something and like me as the new sheriff in 2010. It is with this image that I begin my campaign. Thank you all for very much.